Having a wife sometimes means that I have to come to hospital. Like sometimes I come for physio after I've had a bad break to make my muscles stronger. Like last year I had a really bad break here and then physio helped me to straighten my leg out properly and mend it so then I can walk again properly. But I also come to hospital for psychology because actually having a wife can be really hard sometimes because like you can't go on trampolines like your friends because it really hurts your back and it's um, a risk of breaking and I've really broke quite a lot but I just wish we had a big superhero um, so the psychologist helped me to control my emotions before I don't get so frustrated and angry I also come um, to hospital to have regular checkups like um, see how I'm doing in general, see how I'm doing in school, see how my pains are to see if anything needs to be changed quite quickly. Every six months I also come to hospital to have a little cannula put in my hands which injects bisphosphonate, but like, that's really hard to say, so I just say bone juice, which injects bone juice, um, which makes my veins a little bit stronger, but gradually that makes them a little bit, quite a lot stronger, but it doesn't really work as like a problem. I'm still a bit stronger. Ooh, what, what, what. Most people think that because it's called brittle bones, it just affects your bones, but actually it goes all throughout your body, so it means I'm super, super bendy. It means where everyone's eyes are white, mine are a little bit blue. So overall, it means I'm really special. Sometimes when I'm in a wheelchair people stare at me and they make a big fuss over me but I would just prefer it if they just acted normally and just said hi Erin because even though I break easily and have a wife it means I'm pretty much no different I'm just a normal person it just makes me a little bit special